Welcome back to my channel, DIA with Raul. Today, I'm visiting my sister and her family to help out with some home renovations that they started on the new house. And also just to spend time with them. So here I come, Daniel, Monique, Jordan, and Zaya. As I call the eventually Lunas. Using aluminum foil and blue painter's tape, we temporarily closed up this hole. Now this corner once had a wood burning fireplace and so we had to chisel and scrape off the old mortar. Now all we did was skim coat the wall, prepping it for future texturing. Now in the corner there was a huge crack so we decided to use tape in order to reinforce the corner so that it would not split in the future. Hi guys, my name is Jordy. I'm building a car. Are you gonna go harder? Or? Should put something on this glass table, <laughs> to be completely honest. Yeah, it's Milano. It's a mini Milano. Mini Milano. They found it out, or they found it out. Okay, so now it says number three, so we're gonna flip it upside down, and we're gonna do the, um, this isn't, what is it, axle? Wheel. Mm -hmm. Wheel. Oh, okay, wheel, wheel. Oh, oh wait, wait, no, 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 we do this first. Oh, no, 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 you're right, the wheel, sorry. Go ahead. Sorry. Good job, now put the other wheel. Mm, is that right? What color are you going to paint it? Yes. What color? Let's paint it yellow. Watch your fingers. Mm -hmm. Put your hand on it. Okay, ready? One, two, three. Put your hand on it. Okay, ready? One, two, three. I'm going to go in the room. Yeah, I'll help you. I'll help you. Yeah. I'm the opposite way. Yeah. So you're going to hold it your right hand? Like this? Grab it. A little bit up more. Okay, just one hand. I'm just gonna hammer it down. Okay. See? Got it. Okay. Nice. There you go. There you go. Perfect. All right. All right. All right. I think it's it. Yeah. Good job. Now we gotta do. You put the wheels on, correct? I think it's like a pullback one. Yeah. Okay, this goes on here, but I don't know how it's supposed to stay. Oh, right. The instructions are on the side. You're standing up by the freaking thing. Oh, well, I got a ball. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Can you pull that twig? you're going to want to do so we're going to want to sand all this down so do one to two inches yeah Still 
step on it. So you don't want to do that to the whole one? Um, just where you want it to look smooth. Oh, so, because you're like trying to blend that in. Yeah, so what we're doing is we're blending from this area downwards. And since this is kind of raised for whatever reason, mm -hmm. we're trying to make it as seamless as possible. So all this is going to get sanded down very thin. Mm -hmm. So when we texture, we're going to blend the texture a little bit above it and then downwards. Mm -hmm. So you don't see like a, a, mm -hmm. like a hump. So get more mud if you need to and pull it further. Out or in, yeah, in? so notice how I did this. This oh, is yeah. basically like 12 inches. That's how far you want to pull in. You're about half. Halfway? Yeah, there you go. There you go. Because the farther you pull in, the easier it'll be to sand. You need more? Yeah, grab more if you need it. Now we let this dry overnight and the next day in the morning I grabbed a sanding block and just started sanding away. Now I feathered the top and the bottom and once all that was done we had a nice smooth wall in order to texture. It is the next weekend and I'm back here at my sister and her boyfriend's house with the car full of stuff in order to do a couple projects this weekend. So I got car projects lined up. I got to do texturing on that wall. I didn't bring a compressor last week. Skirt. So here we are, another weekend with the fam. Let's do this. Say hi, Zaya. Yeah, you're in the gym. Laundry room. You got Jordy in the back. The double wrap. Did you really double wrap it? Yeah, got yeah. the single wrap. Well, I made one giant burrito basically, the two small ones. Mmm. What do you think? You like yeah. it? Mm. So it's not gross, huh? Let me see. All right. All right, now getting back to the wall, I used a damp microfiber cloth in order to wipe down all the dust from sanding the previous weekend and I got a hole in my texture so I had to patch it up really quick. All done. All right, so now I was kind of showing my brother-in-law how to texture. Now there's different techniques you could use. At the end of the day, use what best works for you. A week if I want, just keep it fresh. Yeah, but usually both. Here we are at the end of the weekend giving my nephew Jordan a haircut. Then after giving Daniel a haircut, Drop it. I'm just feeling blessed. Had a great weekend. 
had some good food, got some projects done, got the wall done, got some car, car uh, projects out of the way, just leaving them looking fresh as I head home. There you have it, another weekend here at the Lunas. You know, it was a good getaway, got a few things done, got my grill done, I'm stoked about that. I've been trying to do this for about mm, eight months or so, finally got it done. Can't wait to hook up that switch, so next time we'll hook up that switch. Alright, see you later.